huge tree came down on a rooftop. And that's not all. The same tree also hit a couple of cars. WBZ's Bill Shields is live in Sandwich tonight with more on the Cape taking a beating from the winds. Bill? David and Lisa, I'm standing on a beach right here in Sitchwood. Excuse me, Sitchwood. I'm used to Sitchwood. In Sandwich. This is Sandwich. You can see the erosion of the dunes here. Now, several years ago, those dunes were out here, but the winter storms keep eating away at them despite the best efforts of town officials to replace this sand. Let's show you video now of what this looked like where I am standing at high tide at noon today. It is relentless. And sand dunes are no match for an ocean storm. Here in Sandwich, near Town Neck Beach, residents and the town have been fighting erosion for years. It's a very dynamic situation. Dave DeCanto says the town has dropped tons of sand in front of the homes, but the beach needs constant upgrading. So we need to build it back up to a certain part where it can sustain itself somewhat and then we have to keep adding to it. See those giant sort of sandbags? Only the wealthy homeowners can afford those, and the winter storms challenge even the sturdiest efforts. But these winter storms are magnificent to watch. The smell in the air, the ocean, the sound. It's just fabulous, you know? It's very therapeutic. The power of a wind-driven ocean attracts even residents who see it every day. I think it's beautiful, beautiful. It's a little different that's why, I live, that's why I live here. You want to see bigger waves? Yeah. Well, he will likely get his chance. Winter is far from being over, and there's likely to be more storms, more north winds pushing that water right up against the beaches here on Cape Cod. Reporting live from Sandwich, I'm Bill Shields, WBZ News.